everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls, and this is our daily card reading for December 2nd, 2020. So today we have Bring Love Into the Situation, New Moon in Aquarius. Check this out. So this does feel like December has this tying up loose ends, old problems going away. But again, it's not from somebody just coming in and saving you. It's not from spiritual sidestepping and saying, I'm just going to be a, you know, saved by the divine grace of God and I don't have to do anything. I'm just going to sit back and put my feet up. <laughs> it's just going to happen, right? No, this has been a hard won victory. And that does not mean hard won as in outside of you, I fought someone and I won. I won that lawsuit. It amazes me. I've had people come to me and they're so, we were talking about how we get so focused on something that everything else sort of disappears all around them right? And it does have to do with like legalities and things like that. I get it. I love justice too. <laughs> but this is saying, get back in touch with your heart. And this is saying that here, as we're coming into December, we're going to start understanding the importance of this even more. What we're really made of, what our real power is as a human. What is that power? That power comes from love. It comes from um, emanating this peaceful energy as much as we can. If you're not in a peaceful place, it's okay. <laughs> if you're feeling a little riled one day, I, I feel you, right? We're human. We're still going to have the ups and downs and going sideways and going back the other way. I mean, it's, it's a thing, right? <laughs> That's part of being human. But where can you, when you're getting really, really upset about something, breathe into the heart space. Now you don't have to bring, because we hear this all the time. Oh, just give love to the other person. That is such a, <laughs> I'm sorry, that is just such a bunch of hooey, okay? It's just a bunch of, it's not authentic. When you're mad at somebody, you're mad, okay? Like, you're not trying to be like, I love you. It's not real. I mean, maybe you do love them on a deep level, but like, you know what I'm saying? It's fake, okay? It's fake to be like, you know what? I'm mad at you, but I, but I love you, okay? I love you. No, when we talk about bring love into the situation, it means the situation and everyone involved in it. So now we start to diminish the anger. And when we do that and we start getting to that peaceful place, it's where the clarity starts coming. And then when you say, you know what? I love you. I don't want to fight with you. Now it's real. Now it's real. Okay. And now the other person, because it's real, can receive it. Or the situation, you bring a, a loving, you know, peaceful energy to that situation. And now it starts to work itself out. May not be the way you think. Because one of the things that we're all having to learn as human beings is to stop being such spoiled little brats. It's got to be my way. I want it like this. I deserve this. I should have this. We're starting to hopefully <laughs> discover that everything can change overnight. And people fall in and out of love all the time. We fall in and, love, in and out of love with our job situation or our living situation or whatever. We're ever evolving. And so that is going to ask of us to adjust and to have an awareness at all times. So if we can bring love into that, that will just amplify our peaceful resolutions, right? <laughs> uh, things coming to a conclusion and making different choices. All right. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care. Bye-bye.